Welcome to My Tax Prep Office. In this video, we will learn how to use My Tax Portal. My Tax Portal allows you to send engagement letters, organizers, returns for review, and request remote signatures. Additionally, it enables you to securely receive answers and documents from taxpayers. My Tax Portal makes two way communication between tax professionals and taxpayers quick and easy. My Tax Portal can be found in the left side menu of your dashboard. It is also available as a widget. Here, you can choose from Settings, Clients, and View Requests. First, click on Settings. This will enable you to upload your company logo. Simply click in the box and choose the logo image file saved on your computer. You can crop the image to make it exactly the size that you need. Once finished, click Crop and Save Logo. Once your logo is uploaded, make sure that your tax office is in the Company Name section. Click Save. Next, click on Invitation Emails. This is where you will create the email template that will be sent to your client as part of their invitation to the portal. You can edit the template name, subject, and body of the template. Or, you can use the default email provided and simply edit the client name and company name. You may also choose to see a preview of the email. This preview will show you exactly what your clients will receive once you send an invitation. Next, click on Letterhead. Here, you will be able to customize the letterhead to reflect your company's information. The Organizers tab allows you to choose from three organizer templates to send to your client. Or, if you would prefer, you can simply edit to change the type of question or the number of questions provided. Once you are finished with your settings, the next step is to invite clients. Select clients from the left side menu. A list of clients you have within the program will be displayed. Use the filter to quickly locate other clients, or another way to filter clients is to choose either individual or business, as well as active or archived. The exclamation point will alert you that there is missing information for your client, and an invite cannot be sent until all information is complete. The green check mark means the invitation has been sent successfully. Here, you can choose clients to whom you would like to send an invitation. Or, if you would like to enter a brand new client, click New Client. To create a new client, you must enter their information here and click Save. The client will then be added to the list. You can edit a client's information at any time. Once you've made the necessary changes, click Save. You will also find in the drop-down menu there are options to archive a client, delete a client, or print a client's organizer in Office. When you are ready to create the invitation, simply click Create Request. Here, you will be able to choose the communication method for which you would like to send the invite. If you are inviting this client for the first time, select Invite Client to use My Tax Portal. If you would like to send the organizer as a PDF attachment directly to your client's email, select Send Organizer via Email to Client. Lastly, if you would like to print the organizer in Office, select Print Organizer. Next, the email template you previously created will be displayed. Feel free to make any last minute edits to the organizer at this time. Below, you will find the Choose Organizer section where you may select the organizer template you created for your client. After you have selected the organizer, you may choose to include an engagement letter for which we have provided you a template, or you may select Edit and make any changes you see necessary. You may also make any last minute edits to the organizer if desired. After you have completed these steps, select Mail Preview to view a final preview of the invite that your client will receive. When you are ready to send the invitation, click Send. Once your client accepts their invite via email, they will be redirected to the My Tax Portal website where they must complete their setup by creating a password. Once the account is created, they can go inside the portal where the documents are waiting to be reviewed and completed. Here, your clients can read the engagement letter as well as view and answer the organizer. To view recent invitations, select View Requests. Here, you will see a list of all clients who have been sent an invite to the My Tax Portal, as well as clients who received the questionnaire through email, or those that you printed the questionnaire for in Office. This page displays client information, engagement letter status, 
invitation status, and the number of questions completed. If the invitation status shows it's failed, that means the invitation was not delivered and therefore you must resend or send the invite an alternate way. If the invitation status is delivered, that means the invite was sent successfully. With a failed invite, you will have the option to send the invite via SMS, view the request, or resend the invite. If the invite was successful, you will have the option to send the invite via SMS, view or copy the invite, view the request, or resend. To review the organizer, please select View Request. Here, you will have the option to download the engagement letter as well as review your client's answers to the organizer. You can also edit any questions the client has not yet completed. When you have finished making changes, click Save. Additionally, you can start a new request, add more questions if desired, or make adjustments to your settings. Client answers, as well as documents, can be found within the tax return. Open a return from the dashboard. In the bottom right corner, you will find the My Tax Portal tab. When you click on it, you will be able to see all the questions and answers, as well as any document that has been uploaded by your client. This completes the My Tax Prep Office training video for how to use My Tax Portal. Thank you. Thank you.